Hello fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Thursday the 23rd of May 2024, evening time here in Bangkok. Um, I was uh, waiting to start work and uh, it's been cancelled so uh, I won't have to do that. I was actually avoiding the computer room because I didn't really want to come in until, unless I was working. But now I'm actually uh, quite pleased to be in here in the computer room because it gets me away from my cat, Joni the cat is meow it has been meowing for the last couple of hours constantly since he came back from the hospital uh, he's been meowing and unfortunately the uh, there's a new vet working there at, at some some days of the week and she did the same thing last week she bandaged his leg very poorly because she's put the bandage right to the end of his foot and that means he Johnny has a technique where he can work the bandage off a little bit of scraping here and there and it's going to come off I've tried to kind of fix it up myself a little bit but um, I don't think it's going to last and that means it's going to need an extra trip to the uh, hospital again which has annoyed me um, I'm not sure if that's why he's moaning he doesn't like that particular bandage or he's just I think he just really wants to go outside having been a prisoner uh, inside for many months um, anyway uh, I'm I, the, the meowing is driving me crazy so I've got to come in here and get away from it <laughs> yeah all right, let's get on with the game of Sudoku, shall we? This is a new, uh, Los Angeles Times expert level puzzle. I was, was going to talk about. I was going to talk about something in the news. Oh yeah, nice uh, article in the Guardian today about Denmark being the most trusting country. Apparently, uh, I've forgotten the figure now. Seventy-eight percent was it of people believe that most people can be trusted, and I. I'm I'm on their side. I actually think that's true too. I really believe that most people can be trusted. I'm not one of these people who are very suspicious of everybody. Uh, in Thailand, I don't know how that the number would work out, but I think that most people would probably imagine that most people are fairly trustworthy, but m maybe not everyone. And of course, I don't think everyone is trustworthy. All right, but uh, anyway, but in in you know the overall majority and and human beings are generally right on generally okay that's my view of life has always been and will always be i think right let's go on with the game of sudoku now so we've got nines blocking across here i've seen a few things actually we've got nines blocking there i hope i haven't forgotten i saw ones blocking up here like this and i saw at least one more thing no i what was it i saw uh i saw something else where are you? Where are you? I know there is at least one more easy number to be had because I saw it. There it is. Five across there and five across there. Five down here and five down there. Those are a few easy things that I noticed while I was chatting to you. And now I notice nine blocking down here. And nine blocking that square, so we'll get a nine in that square there. Also, we have eight blocking up here and eight across there. Actually, I saw that one as well. I think I saw that at the beginning. Eight goes there, and is there something else? S oh, no. One, six, eight, no, 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 okay. Ah, oh, yeah. Eight across here, eight across there, and eight up there. also down here up there
two down here, two up there, and two across there. Two to the end. Uh, I think we're looking at 1369 here. Am I right? 1369, 1369. Yeah, yes. And 1, 6, and 9 are in the same column. So that's going to be a 3. Ah. Is that the first 3 on the board? It looks like we were not given any 3s at the beginning. How about that? I didn't notice. All right. Interesting. Okay, five blocks across here, which puts five into one of these two squares, which means that can't be five. Five also blocks this square, so that has to be a five there. Uh, five blocking across here and five blocking across it and five up there will give me a five in this square. And I guess we'll have fives in these four squares there. Uh, six blocking across here, across here, and up there will give me a six in that square. And two blocking across here and up here will give me a two here. And two all the way across there puts two into that square. Four and seven block here, so that puts four and seven there, which means this must be a three. nine blocks both of these squares that's got to be a nine and we're left with two and six for this um, column here so one three four Um, our 9 blocking across here puts 9 into one of these two squares, blocking down. 9 blocking from up there and 9 across there means that's a 9.
let's wander through the digits a bit. Six blocking down gives me six there. And uh, one and six are needed in this row and obviously can't go here. So that's going to give us one and six there. And this will be the other number. The other number is nine. And then we've got nine across here, nine down here, nine up there, nine across there. There's, I think, the final nine. Yes, so nine is finished. Now, I, I put something into these four squares here earlier on. It wasn't nine, was it? It was something else. I can't remember what it was, though. Um, is it eights? Let's see. No, it wasn't eights. Uh, but I do see something now. I see eight and five blocking across here, eight and five blocking across here. So I see that's eight of five. And we've got the five blocking up here. So there's the five and there's the eight. Eight down here, eight down there, eight across there. There's our eight. That joins nine as being a finished digit. Uh, here we're looking for a 7. Six blocks down here and across there. So that will give me 6 in that square. And the missing number here is a 3, I think. Hmm, quite close, but the cigar is not there yet. across there. I think it was fives that I put into those squares earlier on. But I've forgotten about it.
I think feel like I've looked all over the grid. <laughs> I can't find it. I mean, I've looked. I know what's missing there, what's missing there, what's missing there, what's missing here. I've looked at these and not found what I'm looking for. To quote a pop song. do have a pair mind you we've got three and four blocking across here that means that three and four are in those squares there and I've got three and four missing from this row so I can say that these two squares are three and four maybe that will do something I don't think so but maybe so this square this square and this square are not three or four they have to be one six seven ah yeah okay so we got one and six blocking that square, so that's going to be a seven. Oh, goody. Seven across there, seven up there, there's our seven. Three blocking up here, there's our three, and this will be a four. Uh, down here, we're looking for a three, I think. Uh, three across there, and down, and down. Give me three in that square. So that was it, that's what I needed to find that three and four this is the four then so four blocking like this there's the four this will be the three also got three across there now four blocking up there there's our four this would be a one one blocking down gives us one in that square this is six um, one number to get here which I think is a six as well and six across there and down there there's a six two down here and down there there's the two and two across here puts two into that square there Seven blocking down here gives us seven there. This would be four. Four across here means that's a four. This is a one. One across here and one down there gives a one there. I actually only need the one down. Uh, what are we looking for here? Is it a seven? I think it is. And the missing number here looks to be a three. What else do we need over up here? Uh, this was four, seven, is it? So we've got four blocking up there. There's the four, there's the seven, seven down here. That gives me seven there. And the missing digit, one. Okay, that's our Los Angeles Times uh, expert level puzzle over for a Thursday. And the cat has stopped meowing, although now I've finished playing the game, I've got to stay in this room. Otherwise, when I go out, he's going to meow at me again. Okay, take care. Bye-bye.